Cheer up, Homer. Can't. Okay. What if you pretended that this couch were a bar? Then you could spend more nights at home with us. Huh? I'm not going to dignify that with an answer. Look on the bright side, Dad. Did you know that the Chinese use the same word for crisis as they do for opportunity? Yes, crisis-tunity. You're right. I've been wasting my life away in that dump for years. That's it. I'm going to find a new bar to drink in, and I'm going to get drunker than I've ever been in my entire life. Bart, where's my wallet? Right here, Dad. Thank you. Wow, classy. Good evening, sir. Would you please leave without a fuss right now? Okay. Hmm. This looks like a nice, friendly place. Sammy, you're too old to go on a date with two twins on the same night you're supposed to marry Diane without Rebecca knowing. Okay, Carl, I'll make you a bet. If this affects my major league comeback, I'll sell the bar. Woody, give me a beer. I think you've had enough, Mr. Peterson. My chiropractor says I can't carry you home anymore. Just give me another beer, you brain-dead hick! I'll kill you! I'll kill all of you! Whoa, settle down, Nami. Gotta save those pipes for karaoke. <gasps> I love you guys. <laughs> Wait a minute. There's something bothering me about this place. I know! This lesbian bar doesn't have a fire exit! Enjoy your death trap, ladies! What was her problem? <laughs> Greetings, good man. Might I trouble you for a drink? Oh, get out of here, Homer. Homer? Who is Homer? My name is Guy Incognito. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Ah! Oh my god, this man is my exact double! <gasps> that dog has a puffy tail! <laughs> Ear puff! Ear puff! <laughs>